guys, Carl Cooper here with On The Black. So as most of you know by now, Ari Dickey recently uh, signed a new contract with the Mets and uh, courtesy of ESPN New York, let me give you some of the details. Uh, Dickey gets a $1 million signing bonus. Uh, he'll make $2.25 million in 2011, uh, $4.25 uh, million in 2012, and then there is a $5 million team option in 2013 or a $300,000 buyout. So uh, he's guaranteed at least uh, $7.8 million over the next couple of years. Uh, and the question I have for you guys, uh, was this a good contract or is this a good contract for the Mets? Um, I've heard arguments on both sides of the fence. Uh, some that support this deal say that Dickey was arguably the Mets' best pitcher last year. Uh, he's a fan favorite. Uh, and because he's a knuckleball pitcher, um, he can log a lot of innings um, and, and pitch uh, you know, deeper into games and, and chew up a lot of innings throughout the year. The flip side of that, some who are against um, the Mets giving Dickey a deal for multiple years uh, say that you know, uh, the Mets only really have one year to go off of where Dickey pitched well and that he doesn't have a track record of pitching well, so why give him multiple years? So interested to hear your guys' thoughts out there. Uh, did the Mets um, give Dickey too many years or too much money? Was this a bad deal for the Mets or is it a good deal for the Mets? I personally am on the side of this is a good deal for the Mets. Um, you know, I feel that that Dickey will be good again this year and that, you know, really in the grand scheme of things, uh, seven point eight million dollars over a couple of years is not really uh, the most amount of money. Now, you know, my thoughts may change depending on the Mets financial situation and how that thing shapes out uh, over the next few months. But we'd love to hear your thoughts. Uh, was this a good deal for the Mets that they gave R.A. Dickey? Let me know what you guys think and I'll talk to you soon.